And you know, in our experience as surfers, man, we all know that the good times come and go. Following the surfing tradition, family and friends said goodbye to one of their own today at Jacksonville Beach. I have had no room in my heart for sadness because of all these wonderful, wonderful people stopping by and saying wonderful things about my son. I, I just had no room to be sad. 44-year-old Jed Davis was an award-winning, lifelong surfer and a friend to surfers all along the first coast. He was always at the beach, and every time there was a surfing contest, I knew he'd come out of the water with a trophy in his hand. Earlier this month, Davis was hit by a car riding his bike at 16th Avenue in Jacksonville Beach. He passed away Sunday. Today, hundreds of people came for one last paddle out with Jed. Did you get a shot of all those surfers out there just for my little boy? It's just an honor to, to know someone like Jed and be a part of his surfing community family. Fellow surfers floated out with Jed's empty surfboard and scattered his ashes. The man they describe as a soul surfer given a final resting place in the surf. He was smooth as a butterfly quick as a flea, a red-hot surfer that was dear to me. His hair blowing in the wind as he was blowing our minds with his quick turns and cutbacks that really made him shine. God bless you, Jed. Aloha. This is the most amazing, incredible thing I have ever seen in my life. This is so wonderful. I love you, Jed. May you catch a 12-footer in heaven. Ryan Duffy, First Coast News, your news leader.